I've made three kind of quite possibly overtly political texts which deal directly with the idea of whether you can exist on your own or not. To just put work in the show that was about how you feel when you feel alone, when you feel existential. Because I think people will come and look at the exhibition and forget about the issues and actually just look at the art and then realise how positive art is and how it can change people's lives and that's the most important thing. The team itself is the miniature statue in bronze is uh, pretty amazing. I'm still um, in shock to be honest. I've never seen anything like it before. It probably broadens people's scope a little bit, what is homeless. People are going to walk through this exhibition for the next month and hopefully they will have a thought about homelessness. They'll have a think about it when normally perhaps they wouldn't. Well, the idea was that this painting was to do a reversal of the kind of traditional sort of society portrait and do something which is about isolation and dispossession. Ben and Sharon kindly volunteered um, and uh, we went to Victoria Park in East, in East London to, um, to set this up. It's been a real privilege actually. Being an artist myself, I need to find, need to get a few tips of the secrets of the trade. The nice thing about this exhibition is it's mixing up the work of um, sort of, you know, established artists with people who are doing art projects through the charity, through Crisis. So this was made especially for Crisis to raise awareness about homelessness and to raise money uh, for homelessness. So you can see that kind of opulence, you know, you can see it's still got its bling on, but then you know, it's kind of bling no more kind of thing, you know. It's got like, you know, these really heavy suitcases on his back. Suitcases are kind of falling off, but also metaphorically, right, his life is kind of falling off as well to pieces. I hope this exhibition will um, raise the plight of the homeless. I think far too many people think it's a problem that's gone away. Um, and um, as we've heard, it's a problem that's increasing.